<laughs> what was that? Oh. <gasps> Look, George! Hmm. But what do pictures of us have to do with magnets? Hmm. Aha! Whoa! <laughs> ah. The board uses magnets and little bits of metal so you can draw on the pictures. How creative, George! Dinosaur! <laughs> what do you think, Daddy? I look great, Pepper. Ah! Not again! <laughs> everyone loves learning about magnets at the Science Museum. Well, everyone except Daddy Pig. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the supermarket. They're going to pay for their shopping at the till. <gasps> huh? Sorry, got to nip to the loo. Use the self-checkout if you like. <laughs> the self-checkout lets you scan and pay for your shopping all by yourself. It's a big shopping <laughs> robot. <laughs> Would you two like to scan the shopping? Yes, please. <laughs> Hello, customers. Hello, shopping robots. Please place bags in the bagging area. Um... Ah! <laughs> yes, George. Mummy's handbag is a bag. This bag is the wrong bag. <laughs> the shopping robot needs shopping bags. This bag is the right bag. Yay! Please scan shopping. Beep. Pepper and George like scanning the shopping. <laughs> Item not scanned. Try again. Oh, um, beep. Item still not scanned. Try again. There is a rather long queue waiting to use the shopping robot. Item not scanned. It's not working. Item not scanned. Item not scanned. Item, 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 items scanned. Yay! Please put ten cartons of juice in the bagging area. Ten? We don't need that much juice. Um, cancel juice. More juice added. Please put 60 cartons of juice no, in the bagging cancel, area. Cancel. Hmm. Oh, this should do it. Oh. Mummy Pig is very good with computers and shopping robots. How do we beat this, Mummy? The pineapple doesn't have a little sticker to scan. We have to find it on the screen. Oh. Pine cones? No. Pine nuts? No. Ah, pineapple. Here we go. Yay! <laughs> Item is too light. Oh, um, how about now? <laughs> Item too heavy. This one. How about now? And now. Stop! <laughs> Press the button on the side. Everyone in the supermarket is trying to help. Too many errors! Oh no! The shopping robot is broken! Sorry everyone, I'm back! Next! Me! 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 Oh, terrific! Everyone loves going shopping! Please scan oh. shopping. But not everyone loves the shopping robot. Today, Mummy Pig has brought Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello, I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh. Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. 
I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. A spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Peppa and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic, <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> There are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh yes! Ah oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. <laughs> Flight egg is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Me! Wow! What is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? <gasps> Ta -da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> Whee! <gasps> and so are you! <laughs> Pepper and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Hello! Hi! Peppa and her family have come to the balloon shop to collect a special balloon for a garden party. Miss Rabbit! Can we have our fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloon? Oh! Wow! Balloon! The balloon shop is full of balloons. Miss Rabbit? <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Bonk! Oh, you found me! I've been lost in the balloon since Tuesday morning. Must be lunchtime by now. It's Wednesday, Miss Rabbit. Oh, anyway, here are all your fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloons. <laughs> ready for the party. All? But we only ordered one. Hmm. Whoa! Oof. <laughs> Um, it says here, 1,000 balloons for Mummy Pig's party. Oh, but we don't need this many, and we can't waste them. What do we do? I know, we can share them. Peppa and her family are giving the extra balloons to everyone in town. Oh, thank you. And one for both of you. Here you go. Red balloon. Green one for you. <laughs> Only 992 to go. This is going to take forever. Uh-oh, and we have to go and set up the party. I have a great idea. Grab some balloons and follow me, everyone. Hooray! <laughs> It is time for the party, and everyone is beginning to arrive. <laughs> Hello, Susie. Here's your balloon. Oh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Rabbit has used the balloons to turn the garden party into a balloon party. Miss Rabbit can make anything with a balloon. <laughs> Or anyone, here you go. <laughs> it looks like me. And this one looks like me. <laughs> this is the balloon Careful, <laughs> <laughs> <Dancing>, Daddy. <laughs> And don't worry if you pop a balloon, because we have lots of extras. Bonk! <gasps> Bonk! <laughs> Bonk! Bonk! 
Ah! <laughs> everyone would have loved Mummy Pig's garden party, but everyone loves the balloon party even more. <laughs> oh. 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 Aha! There's one! Hooray! Today, Peppa and her family have come to the shopping center. Oh, perhaps we'll get out here. I'll park up and find you soon. <laughs> if I can find a space. They've come to the toy shop to find a gift for baby Alexander. There's so many toys! <laughs> <Yay>! <laughs> now what do we think baby Alexander will like? Hmm... <gasps> Maybe this basketball. Or this blaster. Pop, pop. <laughs> or this karaoke machine. <laughs> <Karaoke>. <laughs> These are very fun, but I'm not sure they're right for a baby. Then we'll have to keep looking. <laughs> 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 Daddy Pig finally found a space in the car park. Oh. oh dear. But the parking space is so small, he can't get out of the car. I'll just have to go around again. Whee! Whee! <laughs> What have you found, George? It's like the car park we were in. Car park! <laughs> George loves the toy car park. Baby Alexander does like cars, but I think he is too young for this toy. Oh! What about this ball, George? No! Ah! 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 <laughs> Or maybe this cuddly teddy. No! Whee! George doesn't think any of these toys are right for baby Alexander. <laughs> what about this noisy rattle? <laughs> no! <laughs> vroom, vroom. George only <gasps> likes the toy car park. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Look at this, George. No! <laughs> for you. What a perfect gift for baby Alexander. We'll take it, please, Miss Rabbit. I wonder where Daddy Pig parked. Whee! Hello, everyone. Everyone loves going toy shopping. Oh. <laughs> but Daddy and George really love the car park. Whee! <laughs> Today, Mummy Pig is going for a relaxing day at the spa. <laughs> oh, sorry, Mummy Pig. I've got to close early today. I've got the sniffles. Oh, I was really looking forward to my spa day. Why don't we make a spa at home? Oh, that's a great idea, Peppa. Peppa is very good at having ideas. Hello, Mrs. Mummy. Welcome to the spa. Oh, <laughs> Peppa has turned the living room into a very wow. special spa. First, we are going to, um... What happens at the spa, Mummy? Well, we normally start with a nice cup of lemon water. I can do that. <sighs> I'll get you some lemony water, Mrs. Mummy. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Mm. Thank you, Peppa. This is the lemoniest water I've ever seen. What's next? Next, I'd like to have a foot bath. Yay! Hooray! What's a foot bath? It's a very small bath just for your feet. OK, time for your very small bath just for your feet, Mrs. Mummy. Come on, Daddy. <laughs> Peppa and Daddy Pig are making their very own foot bath. This ought to do the trick. Ah, oh, that's so relaxing. <gasps> Peppa has turned the foot bath into a regular bath. Yeah. 
Here are the boats you ordered, Miss Pepper. <laughs> you have to have bubbles and toys in the bath. <laughs> Wonderful! I'll suggest this to Miss Rabbit. What's next, Mummy? Next, it's time for a massage. Uh, um... Here, lie down on the sofa and I'll show you how it works. Pepper finds the massage very tickly. Your turn, Mummy. Ooh, it's very different to my normal massage. It's a special pepper massage. <laughs> Choo -choo. Now, the last thing I do at the spa is have a mud mask, which is... A mask made of mud. Yes, a special spa mud that's good for your skin. I don't think we have any special spa mud here, though. I've got an idea. Pepper is very, very good at having ideas. We don't need spa mud when we've got muddy puddles. <laughs> They're just like muddy puddle face masks. Pepper loves a spa day, especially when it involves jumping in muddy puddles. Today, Pepper and George are playing grown-ups. Oh gosh, oh gosh, where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? Dinosaur! George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. Uh, 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 right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? <laughs> Silly George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. They go to Dr. Hamster the vet. But you can have a sticker anyway. I think you'd make a very good dentist. <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, the park. <laughs> Stop! You forgot us! Come back! <laughs> vroom! Vroom! <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. Then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always love jumping in muddy puddles, even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. Today, Peppa is dressed up for Susie Sheep's space party <laughs> on the party bus. Another safe landing. Yeah. There's lots to do on the party bus. Hello, Mrs. Alien. Have you seen Susie? I am Susie. <laughs> I'm not really an alien. And I am a robot. I'm a star. And I'm a space princess. Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z 
<laughs> Welcome aboard, everybody! Who's ready for a space party? Yay! Yeah! Yeah! There's a space dance floor. Some yummy space food. Mm, tastes like space. And of course, space party games. Who wants to play Pass the Parcel in space? <laughs> <laughs> when the music stops, you can unwrap a layer of paper. It's your turn, Danny. Hooray! Oh no! My rainbow right pants can't open <laughs> pipe! <laughs> That's alright. There are lots of games robots can play, like Catch the Shooting Star. Are you ready? Yeah! And catch! Oh, uh, oh, nearly! I've got it! I've got it! Oops! <laughs> um, let's play a new game. Stick the eye on the alien. Oh, please, can I try? Let's put on a blindfold so you can't peek. And go! <laughs> oh. <What>? Sorry! <laughs> I think it suits me. <laughs> Is there anything that astronauts, and aliens, and stars, and robots, and princesses can all do together? Well, if everyone straps in, we can all blast off in three, two, one! The party bus is blasting off just like a real spaceship. Whoa. I love flying through space. <laughs> Look! A flying saucer. Everyone loves riding the party bus. It's an alien and a robot. And he's that an astronaut? Why? And everyone really loves blasting through space. Back soon, Mummy. Bye. Daddy Pig has to pick something up from work. So Pepper and George have come with him to his office. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Rabbit. Phew. <laughs> George really likes all the buttons in the lift. Oh, oh dear. All that button pushing has broken the lift. Oh, whoopsie, George. Don't worry, George. I'm a bit of an expert at lifts, you know. Ah. The buttons in the lift aren't working. Hello. Welcome to the lift. <gasps> Is this lift magic? No, it's voice activated, which means we just have to tell it where to go. Much easier. Oh. <clears throat> Hello, lift. We would like to go to my office, please. The lift is working again. Okay. Yay! Floor two. Office off, please. But it hasn't <laughs> taken them to Daddy Pig's office. <laughs> No, not office of bees. Office, please. Office, <laughs> office cheese. <laughs> mm, I love cheese. <laughs> I said office. <laughs> Floor 16. A fish. <laughs> Silly magic lift. <sighs> the lift doesn't seem to understand Daddy Pig's voice. I'll try. Can we go to Daddy's job? Now arriving at the top. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Not the top. Daddy's job, please. Peppa and her family keep trying to get to Daddy Pig's office. But the magic lift takes them to the wrong floors. <laughs> and spooky floors. Oh, hello. And even party floors. <laughs> but none of them are the right floor. Until... My office! Hooray! 
<laughs> Hello, Mummy Pig. We just had a little trouble with the lift. Be there soon. <laughs> Pepper and George really love the magic lift. Uh, uh, uh. But Daddy Pig much prefers to take the stage. Today, Pepper and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars at Potato City. Can't catch me, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, yes, I can! <laughs> Come on, Peppa! We found a new ride! It's a water ride! It's so splashy! I love splashy rides! Splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves splashy rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride without splashes? Like, uh, oh, this bench! Ooh, what fun! Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. Come on, Mummy! Yay! Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery Stick Falls. Uh oh! Oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. Splashy. Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, okay. Enjoy the ride! Oh. oh, this is quite lovely! The ride is going very high up! Splash, 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 we all love to splash! Uh, not everyone loves to splash! Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a humongous splash, please! Yeah! yeah. Okie dokie! Ready? Yeah! No. Five against one. Off you go! The celery stick falls are very fast and very splashy. Nice and dry. No, oh, not again. Yay! <laughs> Yay! That was amazing. <laughs> and very, very splashy. Mummy, what are you doing? The splashes were amazing. Let's go again! Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. <laughs> oh. Yay! Oh. Oh. Aha! There's one! Hooray! Today, Peppa and her family have come to the shopping center. Oh, perhaps we'll get out here. I'll park up and find you soon. <laughs> if I can find a space. They've come to the toy shop to find a gift for baby Alexander. There's so many toys! <laughs> Yay! Now what do we think baby Alexander will like? Hmm... <gasps> Maybe this basketball! Or this blaster! Pop! Pop! <laughs> or this karaoke machine! <laughs> <laughs> These are very fun, but I'm not sure they're right for a baby. Then we'll have to keep looking! <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Daddy Pig has finally found a space in the car park. Oh dear. But the parking space is so small, he can't get out of the car. I'll just have to go around again. Whee! Whee! <laughs> what have you found, George? It's like the car park we were in. Car park! <laughs> George loves the toy car park. Up, 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 
Baby Alexander does like cars, but I think he is too <laughs> young for this toy. Oh, what about this ball, George? No! Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> or maybe this cuddly teddy? No! Whee! George doesn't think any of these toys are right for baby Alexander. <laughs> what about this noisy rattle? <laughs> no! <laughs> vroom, vroom. George only <gasps> likes the toy car park. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Look at this, George. No! For you. What a perfect gift for baby Alexander. We'll take it, please, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> I wonder where Daddy Pig parked. Whee! Hello, everyone. <laughs> everyone loves going toy shopping. Oh. <laughs> but Daddy and George really love the car park. Pepper and her family are at the cinema. Pepper's favorite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly George, we're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary ghost movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. Me. Oh, uh, sorry. <sighs> the seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me, coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whish, whish. Yay, it's starting. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. <gasps> it's the paddy. Yummy. Oh dear. George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh. Pepper has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George. It's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not scary? No. And this magic wand Ooh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh, happy! <laughs> Whoosh! Shh! <gasps> Sorry! Everyone loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. <laughs> Pepper and her family have bought lots of food at the supermarket. And now they have very rumbly tummies. <laughs> What's for dinner? My tummy's making lots of noises. Tonight, we're making tacos. Yay! What's a taco? And how do you make oh, yeah. them? <laughs> It's a delicious food from Mexico. And the best way to make tacos is all together. Pepper, George and Mummy Pig are washing vegetables for their tacos. Let's make sure the vegetables are nice and clean. Splish, splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies clean. Splish, splash, wish, wash, wash the veggies clean. <laughs> splish, splash. 
<laughs> now, Pepper and Mummy Pig are nice and clean too. Now the vegetables are clean, we can carefully slice some onions. Here you go, Daddy. <laughs> What's wrong, Daddy? Don't you like onions? Oh, don't worry, Pepper. The juice from the onion sometimes makes your eyes water. I just need something to cover my eyes. I know. Pepper knows a perfect way to protect their eyes from the onions. These are perfect, Pepper. Ah, onions again, Daddy Pig. <laughs> Now, we'll make some guacamole. Hooray! I love guacamole. <laughs> then you can mash the avocado, Peppa. Peppa likes <laughs> mashing the avocado. It's very fun and messy. Oops! <laughs> Perhaps try a bit more gently, Peppa? Perfect! Now we mix in other ingredients. <laughs> and add a very special squeeze of lime. All right, George. You can have the special squeeze. Yay! Ooh, it's a good job I'm wearing my safety goggles. <laughs> now all the ingredients are ready, it's time to put the tacos together. <laughs> this is the best bit. Take your tortilla, like this. And add your favorite ingredients. <laughs> Pepper likes her taco with lots of guacamole. George likes his taco empty. Mummy and Daddy Pig like their tacos with everything. Mm. Everyone thinks the tacos are very tasty. <gasps> but they've all dropped their filling. Hooray! Now we can put them together again. <laughs> <laughs> Today, Mummy Pig is going for a relaxing day at the spa. <laughs> Oh, sorry, Mummy Pig. I've got to close early today. I've got the sniffles. Oh, I was really looking forward to my spa day. Why don't we make a spa at home? Oh, that's a great idea, Peppa. Peppa is very good at having ideas. Hello, Mrs. Mummy. Welcome to the spa. Oh, <laughs> Pepper has turned the living room into a very wow. special spa. First, we are going to, um... What happens at the spa, Mummy? Well, we normally start with a nice cup of lemon water. I can do that. I'll get you some lemony water, Mrs. Mummy. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Mmm, thank you, Pepper. This is the lemoniest water I've ever seen. What's next? Next, I'd like to have a foot bath. Yay! What's a foot bath? It's a very small bath just for your feet. Okay, time for your very small bath just for your feet, Mrs. Mummy. Come on, Daddy! <laughs> Peppa and Daddy Pig are making their very own foot bath. This ought to do the trick. Ah, oh, that's so relaxing. <gasps> Peppa has turned the foot bath into a regular bath. <laughs> Here are the boats you ordered, Miss Peppa. <laughs> you have to have bubbles and toys in the bath. <laughs> Wonderful! I'll suggest this to Miss Rabbit. What's next, Mummy? Next, it's time for a massage. Uh, um... Here, lie down on the sofa and I'll show you how it works. Peppa finds the massage very tickly. Your turn, Mummy. Ooh, <laughs> it's <laughs> very different to my normal massage. It's a special pepper massage. Choo -choo. Now, the last thing I do at the spa is have a mud mask, which is... A mask made of mud. Yes, 
a special spa mud that's good for your skin. I don't think we have any special spa mud here, though. I've got an idea. Pepper is very, very good at having ideas. We don't need spa mud when we've got muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> They're just like muddy puddle face masks. <laughs> Peppa loves a spa day, especially when it involves jumping in muddy puddles. Come on, Team Supermarket! I've got the trolley! I've got the shopping list! Dinosaur! Hooray! Today, Peppa and her family are at the supermarket. <laughs> Mummy, we've gone past all the food. <laughs> Why is your bag so noisy? We're here! <laughs> wow! We're using a special part of the supermarket today called the refill station. But how do we carry the food? Aha! With these! At the <laughs> refill station, everyone brings their own containers and fills them up with food. OK, team. Daddy and I will read out the shopping list. Pepper and George, you can fill the containers. Ready? Yes. <laughs> Once we're done, your prize will be lunch. Yay. Off we go. Your first item is rice. Found it. George, we need something to put the rice in. Oh. <laughs> um, that's an egg box, George. Oh dear. Peppa and George have put rice in the egg box. Next, please. Oh, the uh, cereal. <laughs> Isn't that a milk bottle? It's perfect, George. Oh, we only spilt a little. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for cleaning, dinosaur. Next is milk. Oh. The milk bottle has already been used for cereal, so no one's sure what to put the milk in. George thinks they should use the ah. juice carton instead. Good idea, George. Next. Next is um orange juice. Ah, Pepper and George have just put milk in the juice carton. We'll have to use the rice bag, George. Wibbly wobbly, wibbly wobbly. Last on the list is pasta. Ooh. Go! <laughs> what? Guess we're having lots of pasta this week. <laughs> now it's time to take the shopping to the till and pay for it. <gasps> what have you got there? We've got... An egg box of rice, a milk bottle of cereal, a juice carton of milk, a sack of pasta, and a bag of orange juice. <laughs> the usual, then. Dinosaur! <laughs> oh, and George's dinosaur had some cereal off the floor. <laughs> <laughs> the treasured train is on its way! Choo choo! <laughs> Yay! Peppa Pig and Danny Dog are driving a train full of gold, silver and... Broccoli! <laughs> Is broccoli treasure? Yes, it's special broccoli made of sparkly diamonds. Peppa and Danny aren't really driving a train. They're using their imagination to pretend. Hooray! Stop! In the name of, um, rubbers! <gasps> oh no! Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are pretending to be train robbers. Can we have all your treasure, please? <laughs> no! Oh, okay. <laughs> You're supposed to steal the treasure, Susie. <laughs> oh! <laughs> We have stolen all the treasure! Hooray! <sighs> um, what do we do now? You escape! Oh, yes! Yeehaw! Yay! Whoa! <laughs> Come!
Come back, you naughty robbers! Now Peppa and Danny are pretending to be police officers. They're going to catch the robbers. Caught us? No, we didn't. Because, um. Ha! Your mm. boat can fly! Oh. Um, Madame Gazelle, can ships fly? Real ships cannot fly. Oh! But pretend ships certainly can. Hooray! Wow! Now, Pedro and Susie are in a flying boat. Oh, um. Oh, a train can fly too! Whee! Yay! Uh-oh! <laughs> hey! Police officers Pepper and Danny have almost caught the robbers. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Is it a giant? No, it's a daddy pig! And he's coming to take you home! Charge! <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? We're pretending to fly our boats and trains, Daddy! Oh my! What an imaginative bunch you all are! Oh! Aha! Peppa loves imagining things! Everyone loves imagining things! <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are playing in the sand pit. <laughs> Peppa is playing with toy cars. She has a fire engine, an ambulance, a digger, and... George, where's the police car? The police car is lost in the sand. Where did you put it, George? <laughs> police car? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We'll find it together. It'll be... Aha! An adventure! Adventure! Peppa and George are pretending they are in a big sandy <laughs> desert. Let's take the fire engine. <laughs> Whee! Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Peppa and George are using the fire engine to search the sand. What? For you, me too. Let's have a drink. Lucky the hose is full of orange juice. Peppa and George love orange juice. Come on. We still need to find the police car. Hmm. Hmm. <gasps> Over there. That sounds like... <gasps> police car! I told you we'd find it. Yay! Adventure! <laughs> now we just have to dig it out. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> uh, this is going to take forever. <laughs> Where are you going, George? <laughs> <laughs> You've turned into a giant. <laughs> Peppa and George have found the police car. Nino, Nino, me. Beep, beep, beep. Um, do you know where the digger is, George? Um. But it looks like they'll have to go on another adventure <laughs> to find the digger. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello everyone! Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? <gasps> oh! What happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice relaxing drive. Oh dear, 
Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race. So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check! Check! Then off we go! <laughs> Whoops! Let's try again! Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus is a bit fast for Madam Gazelle. Miss Rabbit, can the yellow bus play music? The yellow bus can do lots of things. It can do this, 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 and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madam Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round. round. All day long. Play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with R. Roach. Nope. Uh, rabbit. Nope. It's a really big lorry. Oh. Hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh, I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry, I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madam Gazelle. <laughs> Watch out! Today, Peppa and her friends are at the water park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Before you all go swimming, I have some important rules to teach you. Miss Rabbit is telling everyone how to be safe in the swimming pool. The first rule is no splashing. <laughs> no splashing, Mr. Bull. Whoops! Sorry, Pepper. Sorry, Miss Rabbit. That's okay, Mr. Bull. The second rule is no running. <laughs> Silly, Mr. Bull. No running. Sorry again. Mr. Bull doesn't know any of the rules. And the last rule is... Everyone must have a simply splendid time. Oh. Oh. Have a splendid time, Mr. Bull. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Right you are, Peppa. Enjoy the pool, everyone. What shall we do first? Let's go on the water slide. Oh. Hooray! Everyone is very excited to ride the water slides. Hello again! Who wants to go down the slide? Me! <laughs> well, you're in luck. There is one slide for each of you. Let's have a race! Good idea! Lucky I brought my flag. On your marks, get set, go! And Danny Dog zooms into the lead. Followed by Peppa. Then it's Gerald Giraffe and Susie Sheep coming up behind. It's incredibly close. Water slide racing at its best. Hello, Granny. Hello, Mr. Bull.
They're nearly at the finish line! It's neck and neck! Who will come out on top? It's... A draw! Everybody wins! Peppa and her friends love the slides, but they have forgotten the first rule of the water park. Uh -huh. No sliding! <laughs> Today, Mummy and Peppa have brought George Yay! to the doctors for a checkup. Hello, I'm Dr. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. And this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr. Brown Bear need to check George's height. Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. You'll be a big grown-up soon. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall, too. Wow! You're so big and tall, George. Now it's time to check George's weight with a special machine called Scales. This machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> and freeze. <gasps> Mm hmm. And unfreeze. <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a stethoscope. <gasps> this might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh. Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. No. <gasps> oh. <laughs> and one for Dr. Peppa Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Delivery for Mummy Pig. Today, Mummy Pig has received a package. Oh, thank you, Miss Rabbit. I know exactly what that is. Peppa and George are going to love this. Mummy Pig has ordered an ice lolly maker. And it, it looks like a penguin! I thought we'd use all the fruit from Grandpa Pig's garden to make very healthy, very tasty ice lollies! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Yum! Hello, Mr. Penguin. <laughs> How do you work? <laughs> oh, I remember. I had one when I was your age. All we do is... Um... Uh, we just... Uh, <laughs> Mummy Pig does not remember how the ice lolly penguin works. Perhaps we better look at the instructions. <laughs> oh, yes, we need ice for ice lollies. <laughs> the ice goes here and we turn this handle. <laughs> it sounds crunchy. Now we lift up the wing. Oh! <laughs> the ice is all mushy. Now we add the fruit. Mm. 
raspberries, my favorite. <laughs> Next, we pour the raspberry ice mix into these molds. George has the lolly sticks. We use these to make the handles. Good job, George. <laughs> and now, we just need to wait for them to freeze. Let's make more lollies while we wait. Yay! Mmm, <laughs> blueberries, my other favorite. I like kiwi, please. And banana. <laughs> Peppa and her family spend the day making lots of fruity ice lollies. <laughs> and having lots of fun. But eventually... Oh no! There's no more fruit! What are we going to do? Knock, knock. Don't suppose you need lots more fruit from my garden for any healthy, tasty reason, do you? Oh! Yay! More lollies! Um, I'm afraid we can't make any more ice lollies, you two. Mm, why not? Because we have to make space in the freezer by eating these first. <laughs> Peppa loves making ice lollies, especially very tasty fruity ones. Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the cake competition at the town fete. I can't wait to see the cakes! Huh? Oh, why is this shoe here? <gasps> oh, that's not a shoe. <laughs> it's my cake, Pepper. This is a competition for cakes that look like other things. But if the cakes don't look like cakes, People will get confused. That's the idea. Do you want to help me judge which is the best <laughs> cake that doesn't look like a cake? <gasps> yes, please. Pepper is trying to trick Daddy Pig with a cake that looks <laughs> like a phone. Ring, oh. ring, um, ring, ring. Hello. It's a cake. <laughs> Very funny, you two. Ooh. <laughs> Would you like a cup of tea, Mommy? Thank you very much. Oh, this tea is made of cake. The cake tricked you. <laughs> Congratulations on growing the biggest carrot. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> I'm afraid this prize is for the biggest carrot, not the biggest carrot K. <laughs> but it is a very good big <laughs> carroty cake. <laughs> it's time for Mr. Bull to give out the award for the best cake that doesn't look like cake. <clears throat> the best cake that doesn't look like a cake is this one. Ooh. Actually, that's just my lunch. Oh, yes, uh, of course. Uh, well, in that case, the winner is this one. It's very realistic. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's just George. Oh, even I'm falling for them now. Um, then the winner is this one. Mummy Sheep has won first place. You see, it looks like a chocolate cake, but actually, it's strawberry. Oh, Pepper, can you pass us the trophy? Yes, here is your trophy. Huh? The trophy is made of cake, too. <laughs> And now everyone can have a slice. Everybody loves eating cakes that look like other things. Now, where did I put my hat? Uh -huh. And everybody loves getting tricked by them too. Today is Pancake Day. So Peppa and her family are meeting at a fancy pancake restaurant. Hello, I'll be your chef today. I make the pancakes right at your table and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. 
one banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up! Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. And now for the best bit. Smelling. Eating? Yeah. Flipping it! Exactly! Woohoo! Miss Rabbit is very good at making pancakes. Whoa! <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Mm. Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please! <laughs> You clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh. Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut, cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Pepper. <laughs> Pepper and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes. And lots of them. Ta-da! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two... Flip! Pepper and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa! very high and onto <laughs> Mr. Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm! Tore very much! Mmm! It's sweet! Mm, and savoury, crunchy, and ooh, spicy, ooh, delicious. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a special surprise pancake. Oh, mm. okay. <laughs> Peppa and George love making super special surprise pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yeah! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. Mm. Jam, <laughs> eggs, <laughs> tomatoes, ooh, coconut and jelly. It's Mother's Day and Peppa and George are making Yay! a very special <laughs> surprise breakfast for Mummy. Oh, 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 you started Mummy's breakfast without me. What's on the menu? Chefs? Toast! <laughs> Everything on toast! Ah, well, let's get cracking! <laughs> oh, watch out for that, Pepper! Well done, George! A little too much! Uh -oh. <gasps> Careful, George! We have to make Mummy's breakfast extra special to show how much we love her. <laughs> That's right. Ta-da! It's time for jam, George. Mummy loves jam on toast. <laughs> ah. George loves jam on toast too. Mm. Oh, <laughs> Mummy Pig is very Yay. excited for her lovely breakfast in bed. Oh. But the breakfast is smelling a little burnt. The toast, Daddy, the toast. One second, Emma. Ah. Burnt. Maybe this toast can go on the bottom. Good idea. <gasps> Quick, Mummy Pig will wake up soon. <gasps> George! George loves jam mm. so much, he has eaten all of the jammy toast. Lucky there's lots of other things. Egg and beans. Tomatoes and cucumber. 
cheese and mustard. Jelly? A whole coconut. Yeah. Yay! Maybe I should check on them. <laughs> oh. One, two, three. Happy, Happy Mother's Day! Day. Oh, uh, oh! 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 What a surprise! We made everything on toast! Everything except jam! <laughs> Mummy Pig loves her everything on toast Mother's Day breakfast, <laughs> even without the jam. <laughs> Hello! Peppa and her family are ordering lunch at a sandwich shop. Peppa, we don't order at the counter in this sandwich shop. No. We order at the special screens. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Why don't you have a go at ordering a sandwich, Peppa? <laughs> Ooh! <gasps> You can select different toppings for your baguette by pressing the pictures. I'm very hungry. <laughs> I want a really big, long baguette, please. Lettuce, tomato, and lot of cheese! Pepper is adding lots of cheese, and her sandwich is getting bigger and bigger. I know you're hungry. But that might be a bit too much cheese. Oh, <laughs> okay. Now press the send button so the chef can make your order. The chefs have received Pepper's order from the machine and are hard at work making it. It looks so yummy and cheesy. Now it's George's turn to pick his sandwich. <laughs> Look, that children's meal comes with a special surprise. Surprise! <laughs> George can't wait for his special surprise. Now it's Mummy Pig's turn to order. I'll just have my usual. Tomato and mushroom with six pickled onions, two cheese slices, olives, no cucumber, half a red pepper, and a sprinkle of chili sauce, and a whole wheat poppy seed baguette. Um, did you say... Cucumber? Surprise! No, no! George, no! Surprise! Uh-oh! George, no! I suppose it's always good to try new things. Pepper and George are enjoying their lunch while they wait for Mummy's extra special sandwich. Mmm, it's very cheesy. <gasps> Dinosaur! Surprise! Mummy Pig's sandwich is being made. It's a bit bigger than she expected. Uh, it's ready, Mummy! Oh! How, um, big? Oh. Oh. I don't think I can eat all this on my own. Would you like some? Oh, it's a bit small. I see. Mmm, but very tasty. Mm. I might have a new favorite. <laughs> Everyone loves their sandwiches, even if they aren't exactly what they meant to order. Today, Mummy Pig has brought Pepper and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello, I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy! Ooh! Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot, or a princess, or a silly monster, or a... <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> oh, I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, good choice! <laughs> Lovely! A spaceman! A monster! A superhero! Pepper and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot! 
dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic... <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> There are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh yes! Ah oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. <laughs> like it is fun. Wee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa! Wee! Wow! What is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> <laughs> and so are you! <laughs> Peppa and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Yummy tasty food. Yummy tasty food. Today on the cruise, yum, Peppa yum. and her family are at a very special oh. type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Peppa? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? <laughs> I think we can rustle up some orange juice. <laughs> Let's see here. Aha! Ooh. The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. Juice! We'll just have to make some more. Delicious. I can't wait to... Finished! Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Peppa. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right. Peppa has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid! Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited ah. to eat her spaghetti. Ah! Finish! Oh, thank you, Pancake Robot. But now, Pepper is thirsty uh. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's oh. taking him so long. Mm. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a cup of orange juice. In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. <laughs> oh. The machine has finally stopped oh. making orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa, you don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Peppa loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Today, Peppa and Daddy Pig are ready for Mr. Bull's karate class. Hiya! <gasps> wow, look, Daddy. Uh, yes, impressive. Welcome, everyone. 
Ooh. In karate, it's important to bow to show respect. Excuse me, Mr. Bull. Yes, young Pepper. Why is everyone wearing different color belts? Oh, the belts show how much practice you've had. Mine's black, because I've been doing this for a long time. Peggy and Pandora have orange belts, because they've done lots of lessons. And since it's your first lesson, you and Daddy Pig have white ones. Oh, so can we try the choppy board thing now? I don't think we're quite ready for that. <laughs> That's right, it takes a lot of practice, so we better get started. Come on, everyone. <laughs> Gotta be quick for karate and jumpy. Hup. Did it? Lovely. Next, we need to learn how to practice breathing. Ah, I'm a bit of an expert at breathing. Been doing it my whole life. <laughs> <laughs> Breathe in. <gasps> Ichi, knee, san, chi, and out. <sighs> knee, san. <laughs> Mr. Bull, why are you saying itchy knees? Itchy knees? Oh no! This is how you count in Japanese. Itchy, knee, sen, chi. See? Oh! <laughs> Righto, now it's time to practice balancing. Peggy, Pandora, why don't you show us? To be good at karate, you also have to have very good balance. Righto, class, your turn. <laughs> Fab! We'll keep practicing that next time. Mr. Bull, is it time to do the choppy board thing now? Now it's time to do the robot. The, the robot? robot? Put your robot arm up, then put your robot arm down. Robot arm up. Arm down. Hello, Robot Daddy. <laughs> Hello, Robot Pepper. <laughs> Mr. Bull has brought out a special choppy board, but Daddy Pig isn't sure he and Pepper are ready. Don't worry, this board is only made of very soft foam. Right, Pepper, are you <laughs> ready to do the choppy thing? But I don't know how. Yes, you do. Robot arm up, robot arm down. Hiya! <gasps> I did it! And to celebrate, here is a very special belt. Pepper and Daddy love their first karate class together, <laughs> and Pepper really <laughs> likes her new belt too. Hello! Hi! Pepper and her Morning. family have come to the balloon shop to collect a special balloon for a garden party. Miss Rabbit! Can we have our fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloon? Whoa. Oh! Wow! Boom! The balloon shop is full of balloons. Miss Rabbit? <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> Bonk! Oh, you found me! I've been lost in the balloon since Tuesday morning! Must be lunchtime by now! It's Wednesday, Miss Rabbit. Oh! Anyway, here are all your fancy, planet-friendly, recyclable balloons! Ready for the party! All? But we only ordered one! Hmm. Whoa! Oof. <laughs> Um, it says here, 1,000 balloons for Mummy Pig's party. Oh, but we don't need this many, and we can't waste them. What do we do? I know, we can share them. Pepper and her family are giving the extra balloons to everyone in town. Oh, thank you. And one for both of you. Here you go. Red balloon. Green one for you. <laughs> Only 992 to go. This is going to take forever. Uh-oh, and we have to go and set up the party. I have a great idea. Grab some balloons and follow me, everyone. Hooray! <laughs> 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 it is time for the party, and everyone is beginning to arrive. <laughs> Hello, Susie. Here's your balloon. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Miss Rabbit has used the balloons to turn the garden party into a balloon party. Miss Rabbit can make anything with a balloon. <laughs> or anyone. Here you go. <laughs> it looks like me. And this one looks like me. <laughs> This is the balloon red. <laughs> Careful, Daddy. <gasps> and don't worry if you pop a balloon, because we have lots of extras. Bonk. <gasps> Bonk. <laughs> Everyone would have loved Mummy Pig's garden party, but everyone loves the balloon party even more. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house? Please? Please? Hello, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. Hey! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Pepper is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Pepper and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh. And it's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> Look, after the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Yay! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone <laughs> loves the fun house because the fun house is very... Paper games. Pepper and her friends are at playgroup today. Children, today we are playing paper games. Ooh. Watch this. I fold the paper. Tuck the corners in, fold these bits, and I have a paper hat! Wow! Can you make other paper things? Oh, yes! My hat can be folded into a little boat! Ooh. Madame Gazelle, I can make a paper tree! Fantastic, Molly! How do you make a tree? I roll the paper up and stick tape on it. Okay. Is it a tree with no leaves? A grown-up has to cut the leaves. I am a grown-up. Good. Now, everyone, watch this. A paper tree full of leaves. That is the best thing I have ever seen in my entire life. Really? Well done, Molly. Oh, I know a funny paper game. What game is that, Pedro? 
heads, bodies and legs. Oh, yes, that is a very funny game. Everyone take a piece of paper. Now, Pedro, tell everyone what to do. You draw a head at the top. <laughs> <laughs> I'm drawing a bird's head. I'm drawing a robot's head. <laughs> Shh, keep it a secret, children, until the end of the game. Fold the paper to hide the head. That's good. Now give your paper to someone else. <laughs> Draw a body and make it funny. <laughs> Keep it secret. Don't show anyone yet. Fold the paper and give it to someone else. Do we draw legs now? Yes, any legs you want. Hairy, spotty or scaly. <laughs> Are you all finished? Yes! Now you have to say who the drawing is. Yes, you could say it is anyone in the world. OK, I know who this is. Who is it? It's Madame Gazelle. <laughs> Madame Gazelle has a duck head, a hairy body and spotty feet. Ah, so that is what I look like. Yes. It's like a photo of you, Madame Gazelle. Very funny. OK. Danny, who is your drawing? It is Madame Gazelle. Oh, so this is me too. <laughs> Madame Gazelle has a robot head, a snake body and bird feet. Are all the drawings of me? Yes. You've got a flower for a head. A spider body and octopus feet. All the drawings are Madame Gazelle. Well, I never knew I looked so strange. Shall we play another paper game? Yes! Okay, we are going to make drawings that move. Drawings that move? Yes, fold a piece of paper in half, draw something on the inside, then draw it a little bit different on the top. We flip the paper and the drawing moves. The little stick figure is walking. This is called animation. Wow! Now you all have a go. I'm drawing a little bird. The bird is flying. I'm doing a bouncing ball. Boing, boing, boing! The ball is bouncing. <laughs> what a lovely animation! Oh, it takes a long time to do this. Oh, yes, you need patience to do animation. <laughs> Look what I've done! It's me! Peppa is jumping up and down in a muddy puddle. Splash, splash, splash! Peppa loves paper games. Everyone loves paper games. <laughs> Roller disco! Pepper and her friends are going to a roller disco. <laughs> I love roller disco for me too. <laughs> Madame Gazelle is in charge. Keep going round and round in a circle, children! <laughs> Pepper and George have their roller skates on. Would you like me to walk around with you both, holding your hands? No, Mummy. We are good at skating. <laughs> Pepper and George love roller skating. Whoa! Are you OK, Emily? Yes, Daddy. I'm fine. Simon Squirrel and Belinda Bear are doing the music. They are big clap, children. Clap, clap. <sighs> I wish we could play something grown up. Clap, the Linda clap, Bear clap. is nearly ten years old. What should we play next? The wheels on the bus, please. Oh, I can't seem to find wheels on the bus. Look, there it is. Ah, uh, thank you, Madam Gazelle. Wheels on the bus. Go <sighs> round, round, round. This music is so babyish. The wheels on the bus go round, round, round. Hello, George. Hello, Daddy. Hello, Emily. This is fun. It's the first time I've been to one of these things. How many times do the children go round? Uh, hundreds and hundreds of times. Ah, 
That children love going around in a circle hundreds and hundreds of times. Hello, Daddy! Hello, Peppa! Hello, George! Here is Susie Sheep. <laughs> Come on, let's stay together! Okay! <laughs> Freddy Fox is going the wrong way! Look out, Pedro! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone go the same way so you don't bump into each other. <laughs> Hello, Daddy! <laughs> Hello, Papa! <laughs> Hello, Mommy! <laughs> Hello, Mandy! Hello, Daddy! Hello, Emily! Hello, Daddy! Hello, Molly! <laughs> Hello, Mommy! <laughs> Hello again, Peppa! Hello again, Daddy! <laughs> Hello again, Emily. What a surprise seeing you here. <laughs> All day long. Now that baby music is finished, we can play something good. I've got just the one. Can we have one potato, two potato, please? <sighs> We have to be quicker with our own music next time. Yes, I've got it ready to play. Wow, Daddy is going backwards. Ooh, how do you do that? I don't know. Quick, it's over. Put our record on. Yeah, time for some real music. Pepper and her friends do not know how to skate to this music. Oh my word! This is my all-time favorite song. Skate on down. Nothing deserves roller skates or flashing. Madame Gazelle is very good at disco roller skating. Wow! I wish I could do that! Me too! And me! All together! Everyone join me! <laughs> Hello, Daddy! Hello, Emily! Hello, Mommy! Hello, Mandy! Hello, Daddy! Hello, Molly! Hello, Mommy! Hello again, Peppa! This is the best roller disco ever! <laughs> Peppa loves roller disco. Everyone loves roller disco. Families. Peppa and her friends are in playgroup. Children, today we are going to do drawings of our families. Ooh. This is me. I live on my own in a very tall house. Sometimes my two sisters come to visit. And we play music. Greta plays bass. Greta plays drums. And I play guitar. We rock! That is my family. Now it is your turn. <laughs> this is me, Susie Sheep. I live with my mummy. She likes to push me on the swing. Higher, mummy! Higher! <laughs> and that is my family. I am Mandy Mouse. Here is me with Mummy and Daddy. We like playing in the park. To you, Mandy. <laughs> to you, Daddy. Yes, everyone likes playing in the park. Who's next? Hey. What a lovely drawing, Pedro. This is Mummy and Daddy and me, Pedro Pony. I have glasses. Daddy has glasses. Mummy has contact lenses. Amazing! How about the panda twins? Pandora and Peggy are doing their drawing together. Daddy is a police officer. And Mummy is a firefighter. Sometimes Daddy drives us in his police car. Daddy, can we do the siren? Yes, please, can we do the siren? Now, girls, you know the siren is only for emergencies. Please! Oh, all right then. <laughs> Super! And Danny Dog? My daddy is a sea captain. 
He has adventures on his boat! But now Daddy has come home to me and Mummy, and he won't go back to sea ever, ever, ever again. <laughs> what a wonderful adventure! Who's next? I'm Penny Polar Bear. I live with my mummy and my other mummy. One mummy is a doctor and one mummy cooks spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Lovely Penny. And Freddy Fox? My dad has a van. It has everything in the world inside it. In packs of five. <laughs> Super. And Rebecca? This is me with Mummy, Daddy, Richard, Rosie and Robbie. We live in a hill. Sometimes my auntie Miss Rabbit visits. Oh, it's nice to have a break from all my jobs. The rescue service, please. I'm stuck up a mountain and I need rescuing. Oh, Dad, not again. OK, I'm on my way. Miss Rabbit is always busy because she does all the jobs in the world. Yes, what would we do without Miss Rabbit? Who's next? I am Peppa Pig. And this is Mummy and Daddy and my little brother George. George thinks his toy dinosaur is scary. It is not scary. But if I don't play, he cries. It's hard work having a little brother. <laughs> the parents are here to collect the children. Hello, Hello mummies and daddies. Come and find yourself on our wall. Oh, is that me? Yes, mummy. And that's you, daddy. Oh, oh, it looks exactly like me. Yes, what wonderful drawings of the families. I love families. Peppa <laughs> loves families. Everyone loves families. Talking. Peppa and her friends are at playgroup. Hab Spaß, mein kleines Lama. Das werde ich bestimmt. Ich freue mich so sehr auf mein erstes Mal im Kindergarten. What is that little girl saying to her mummy? Auf Wiedersehen. Hello there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Good morning, children. Good morning, Madame Zau. Today we have a new pupil joining us. Her name is Lottie Lama. Hello, everyone. Hello, Lottie. Please make Lottie feel welcome. Yes, yes we, we will. will. Hello, Lottie. I'm Peppa Pig. <coughs> Hello again. You were talking funny with your mummy. I was talking German. Can you do some more German talking? What shall I say? Say, hello, I'm Lottie. Hallo, ich bin Lottie. Wow! Do you talk German a lot? Mostly with my mama. She comes from Germany. Ooh. How do you say, I like carrots? Ich mag Karotten. <laughs> How do you say, please open the window? Bitte mach das Fenster auf. Bitte mach das Fenster auf. Yes, that's right. Watch this. Madame Gazelle? Yes, Pedro? Bitte mach das Fenster auf. Of course. Oh, how did you know what I was saying? Because I can speak German. Ooh. If you learn languages, you can talk to all the people of the world. Say something then. Ciao, bambini. That is hello, children, in Italian. Wow. Do another one. Ciao, Pagno. Nimon hao. That is hello, children, in Chinese. Do it again. Oi, meninos. That is hello, children, in Portuguese. Madam Gazelle can speak all the languages of the world. Madame Gazelle, can we learn all the languages? Of course! But let's start today with German. And I think Lottie will be a very good teacher. Thank you, Madame Gazelle. The best way to learn is to play. <laughs> it is playtime. <laughs> okay, I'm going to teach you German. 
Who is good at numbers? <laughs> Me! Look! One, two, three! In German you say Eins, zwei, drei! Now it's your turn! <laughs> eins, zwei, drei! Wow! How do I say? Hello, I'm Peppa Pig! <laughs> Hallo, ich bin Peppa Pig! <laughs> Hallo, ich bin Peppa Pig! <laughs> it is home time, and the parents have come to pick up the children. Daddy, I can talk German. That's fantastic, Peppa. I know some German words. Bitte füllen Sie mein Auto mit Kartoffeln. Wow! What does that mean? It means, please fill my car with potatoes. Ah! That's why I could never get any petrol. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. Mama, Mama! Hello, Lottie. How was your first day at Playgroup? It was great. I made lots of new friends. Hallo, ich bin Peppa Pig. Wow, you can talk German. Yes, I can. Oh, meine kleine Süße. Du bist aber ein schlaues Kind. Welches ist dein Lieblingswort auf Deutsch? Uh, yes. Peppa <laughs> loves talking. Everybody loves talking. Parachute games. It is a lovely sunny day at Playgroup. Pepper and her friends are hard at work painting pictures. I'm painting a tree with all the leaves. I'm painting a rainbow with all the colors. What wonderful paintings, children! You have worked hard, so now it's time for play. Hooray! <laughs> Look what I have! It's a rainbow parachute! And we are going to play games with it! Ooh. First, I want the little ones to hold the parachute edge. George, Richard, Edmund, Zuzu and Zaza are holding on to the parachute. And give it a wiggle like this! Wiggle, wiggle! Look at the way the parachute moves! It is like the sea! Imagine a little boat sailing on that sea! The boat bobs up, the boat bobs down. I will put this little toy boat on our sea. The boat, the boat bobs, bobs up, the boat bobs down. The boat bobs up, the boat bobs down. A bobby bobby bobbing, bobbing the ground. The boat bobs up and down. And the little boat sails away. Say bye-bye to the boat. Bye-bye. Okay, now it is the turn of the big children. <laughs> Pepper and her friends are holding the parachute. Imagine a flying saucer. I'm a flying saucer. I spin through space. Together, we are going to turn this parachute into a flying saucer. On the count of three, we lift the parachute up and then let go. Are you ready? Ready? Yes, Madame Gazelle! One, two, three, and lift! Up, up, up! And let go! Wow! The parachute looks like a flying saucer. I'm a flying saucer, I spin through space. I spin and I spin and I spin all day. I spin and I spin and I spin all day. It really is spinning! Wow! How does it do that? If you want the full explanation, I could set aside time to go through it later. Yes, thank you, Edmund. Edmund Elephant is very, very clever. <laughs> now everyone hold the parachute. <laughs> All of the children are holding the parachute. Imagine a cooking pot with corn popping. I will use ping pong balls for the corn. What happens now? Well, now the pot gets hotter and the corn is ready to pop! Pop, pop, pop! Pop, pop, pop! Pop, 
It is home time and the parents have come to collect the children. Wow, you're playing parachute games. Oh, I loved playing parachute games when I was little. My favourite was the rainbow game. Well, we could all play the rainbow game. Yes, please. <laughs> Everyone is holding the parachute. Lift the parachute up, up, up. Now step in and pull down. <laughs> Everyone is inside the rainbow parachute. Oh, it's just like we are inside a rainbow. It's brilliant. I wonder how it stays up like this. I'm very glad you asked. In simple terms, it's a rainy sunny day. The rainbow's here today. Rainbow, rainbow. Red and orange and yellow and green and purple and blue. Rainbow, rainbow. It's a rainy sunny day. It's the best rainbow ever! Peppa loves parachute games. Everybody loves parachute games. Ooh. Breakfast club! Peppa and her friends are going to play group earlier than usual this morning. Good morning, children. Good morning, Madame Gazelle. Who knows why we have come to play group early today? Is it because we didn't learn enough things yesterday? No, Danny, that is not the reason. Is it because you like us so much? Well, I do like you all, but it is not the reason. Is it a very special day today? Yes, Pedro. We have all come to play group early because today is breakfast club. Ooh. And who knows what we do at breakfast club? Eat our breakfast. Correct. I love eating breakfast. So do I. Me too. Everyone <laughs> loves eating breakfast. And why is it so important to have a good breakfast? Because breakfast wakes your mouth up. So we can do lots of talking. Talk, 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 talk. Yes, yes, thank you, Peppa. <laughs> I eat breakfast because it tastes nice. Yes, Pedro. And breakfast gives us energy to use throughout the day. Ah. Uh, what is energy? Energy is the strength and vitality required for physical or mental activity. That's right, Edmund. <laughs> so, Rebecca, what do you use your energy for? I use it for hopping. <laughs> Very good. I use energy for thinking. What's he doing? Edmund is thinking. Yes, I was thinking. Edmund Elephant is a clever clogs. <laughs> it can take a lot of energy to think. Ooh. And now we will all choose what to have for breakfast. We have bread, cheese, jam, porridge, yogurt. May I have carrots for my breakfast, please? Yes, you may. Can I have cereal, please? Of course you can. <laughs> Madam Gazelle? Can I have toast, please? Yes, Susie. I shall make you some toast. Does anyone else want toast? No, thank you. Okay, the bread goes in here, and we push this lever down. The toaster gets very hot, so please do not touch it. And wait for it. It's coming any minute. Hoppla! Got it! Wow! Can I have toast, please? I'm I'm me. I'm me. Everybody wants toast for breakfast. Well, in that case, I will have to use the big toaster. Ooh. It's a super toaster. <laughs> Plates ready, everyone. Wait for it. Here it comes. Everyone has caught their toast. Again, again, again! No, children, eat the toast you have first. <laughs> Can I have honey on my toast, please? Can I have marmalade, please? Of course, children. 
I'm having strawberry jam on mine. I'm having honey, marmalade and strawberry jam on my toast. <laughs> I'm getting lots of energy in my tummy. So am I. I'm getting strawberry jam energy. I'm getting honey jam and marmalade energy. Everyone has lots and lots of energy. And now it is time for us to do a breakfast bounce. Follow me! <laughs> Use the energy from the food to get our bodies and minds ready for the day. Copy me, children! Egg, apple, yogurt, pancake and toast. Which one for breakfast do I like the most? Toast, honey, egg, yeah! Toast, toast, toast! Winter Games Today, Pepper and her family are skiing on Snowy Mountain. Which way shall we go? One side of the mountain is a nice gentle slope. The other side is very, very steep. Well, I certainly don't want to ski down the steep side like I did last time. <laughs> yes, that was quite spectacular. Last year, Mummy Pig skied down the mountain. Past the shops, all the way home. And she won the Winter Games Cup. <laughs> you skied so well, Mummy. Yes, well, I didn't actually mean to do it, so that's not happening again. Okay, let's go this way then. <laughs> Daddy, Mummy, Pepper and George are skiing down the gentle slope. Here are George's friends, Richard, Edmund, Zuzu and Zaza. George and his friends are skiing together like a long caterpillar. Hello, Peppa. It is Susie Sheep. Hello, Susie. I love this bit. It's all wibbly-wobbly. Wibbly-wobbly-woo. <laughs> Here is Mandy Mouse. She has a mono ski. Hello! Hello, Mandy! Look at me go! <laughs> Here is Danny Dog. <laughs> he is on a snowboard. Hello, everyone! Hi, Danny! Look at me jump! <laughs> Wow, you're all skiing so well! Yes, you're almost as good as Mummy and me! Mr. Pig, what is your best ski trick? Can you go backwards? Backwards? I think that's impossible! Yes, I don't think anyone can ski backwards! Oh, oh. <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the bottom of the slope! That was good! Again! Again! Yes! Let's get the ski lift! This is the ski lift. It takes everyone to the top again. <laughs> Skiing is my most favourite thing in the whole wide world. Oh, Mandy, I thought your favourite thing was cheese. Ah, yes. Cheese is good too. <laughs> Everyone is back at the top of Snowy Mountain. Now we ski down again! Yay! Let's go! <laughs> Stop! Hang on a moment! Since we're all together, it's a great chance to get a photo! But, Mummy, we want to ski down again! Oh, it won't take a moment! Everyone squish together so I can see you all in the picture! That's good! I just need to go back a bit to get you all in! Uh, Mummy Pig, you know you're standing on the edge of the mountain. Yes, yes, good! I can almost see everyone now! There! Big smile, everyone! What? Here we go again! Mummy Pig is skiing down the mountain backwards! Whoa! Quick, everyone, to the rescue! <laughs> Don't worry, Mummy Pig! We're right behind you! <laughs> Mummy Pig is skiing past the shops yeah! all the way home! Mummy's going to hit the house again! <laughs> We're never going to stop! And on to the cliff! Oh, Mummy Pig! 
Mummy skied all the way here backwards. Backwards? That is amazing skiing. Here is the Winter Games Cup again. Oh, thank you. My mummy is the best at skiing. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa loves winter games. Everyone loves winter games. <laughs> Guinea pigs! Peppa is at the playgroup with her friends. <laughs> Today, children, I would like to show you my pet guinea pigs. Aww, they're so cute. This is Ginger. He is very clever. <laughs> and this is Brian. He is very sensitive. 